Hi everyone, welcome back to OT Sophie. I really thought about this because I had multiple questions from parents of my students and various patients as well as other professionals asked me this before. I put together a video where you can learn about different vital signs. The first vital sign we'll go over is the heart rate. I have a special device that's called an oximeter. You might have heard of it before if you're a health professional, but if you're somebody who's never really seen it before or here for the first time, this is what it looks like. It's a device that's called a pulse oximeter. It's pretty cool and I would recommend this to anybody that has a family member who has a condition with respiratory issue, heart problem, or, or other factors. To use this little device, you just press this button. See that? It shows you exactly what it's going to test. So I'm putting in my pointer finger and I'm going to see how much it's going to come out to. I'm waiting for it. So my oxygen is 98. And my heart rate is 67. I'll show you. Usually you have the patient or individual hold their finger up like this and you'll get the test result faster. This is what it looks like. I'm going to show you how to use a blood pressure machine. I just need to put it together. Just give me a moment. This is how it looks. The system. It tells you exactly how to place this on your arm. There's a picture that shows all the steps to test for your blood pressure. You usually put it over your left arm, over the artery line, and above the elbow. So I'll show you how it's supposed to look. It's supposed to look like this. I brought this down a little bit just to show you how it looks. So I'm supposed to stay seated in order to get the accurate result. I'm pressing start on this. Sorry, I was unable to show you how to use the machine. However, now you know how to exactly to place it. And in reality, you're supposed to sit with your feet flat on the floor when you're getting tested and you're not supposed to move. You remain seated. You can do breathing. Can look around but try not to move when someone is testing your blood pressure machine and getting your results this is the machine i would recommend using it's great yeah now i'll go over the exact values and stuff like that this week's topic is on vital signs here's a beautiful water wave the normal values that usually get tested for patient or an individual our heart rate, 60 to 100 BPM. That's the appropriate rate for an adult. Usually kids are at a faster pace. Blood pressure, less than 120 over 80. Oxygen level, 90 and up. Respiratory rate, 12 to 20 breaths. Do you understand what is essentially needed for life to check your health and to see if your oxygen rate and heart rate is doing well? I hope you share this video with other individuals who may benefit from it, as well as learn from this. Thank you for watching.